use that scratch box. Hey, uh, Jakey, how old are you? Five? Okay. Welcome to the Outdoor Coach. This week, we have a special guest, uh, Jacob Pentecost. Um, Jacob is uh, the son of world-renowned uh, turkey call builder, Mike Pentecost, that owns Woodhaven Outdoors, world-renowned turkey hunter. Jacob is a uh, world champion turkey caller, and he's also a great turkey hunter. Now, Jacob's one of the few that's actually killed the entire slam with a 410, and he's killed multiple birds. Do you want to share anything with that, Jacob? Well, if Dad first started me off when I was six years old, or probably five years old, just walking in the woods before school with my lunchbox, just playing around with them. Then at six, when I was six years old, he started taking me out. And that's when I completed the single season double grand slam with a 410 as the only six year old to ever do it. So Wow, then, so at six years old, you killed a double grand slam, double grand slam with a 410 shotgun. That's pretty awesome. If I were going to try to start turkey hunting, what call would I start with to start with? And what did you start with? So in my opinion, I would start with a cherry rib hand. This is where I started on. This is what dad got me hooked on when I was six years old. I was running it in the basement just learning how to do it. Which is a box call. Yes, sir. Now I know that in your line of box calls here at Woodhaven, uh, you probably got about uh six maybe but this one is what you're saying would be your go-to for somebody just starting out all right i'm gonna get jacob and uh, i'm gonna introduce my two boys uh, berkeley and fisher who specifically are in the fishing world now they hunt a little bit but they've never turkey hunted they've never called a turkey all right i've got berkeley i've got fisher we got Jacob. All right, Jacob. I want you to uh, give us a lesson in turkey calling. All right, so this is a cherry reel hen. This is what, what Haven makes right here. So uh, as a beginner, I always start out using this. So it's very simple. There's not a turkey call on this earth that you can run that has to have a lot of pressure. So I'll put my hands right here very light. My thumb on here not bearing down at all. Just keeping it there. And then very lightly just start clucking. And then start yelping, grab the handle, and very lightly just pinch the edge right here. And just, you don't have to pick up the lid. That's the number one mistake I see a lot of people do. They start doing this. You don't only have to pick up the lid, just go back and forth. That's the simple basics of using a box call. Now, how many yips and how many clucks? I know you can over call and uh, under is probably better than over, right? To strike a turkey, uh, just two clucks, then just plain yelp, five, six notes. Just. Then I'll do that one to two times. Oh, that's pretty awesome, dude. All right, we got two beginners with you. Jacob, This year, they're in your classroom. See what you can do with them, Big Daddy. Try to show them uh, that simple, those two little simple things right there. We don't want to try to overdo. We want to basically underdo. So take it away. So right here, you're just going to put your all four fingers right here. Or you put, I put my pinky against this. Put my thumb just right here. Or you want to cluck. Put your thumb right here very lightly, and you're just going to tap it. So, well, I'm going to put my whole pad of my thumb on the box. So you ain't got to put it far. Just put it right there, so there's a little groove right there. 
Straight up. Yeah, he's getting it. Yeah, that's basically it right there. And now, to yelp, you're just gonna hold it. A lot of people grab it like this, and they pick it up like this. So, I like to do it. These grooves right here, is to put your thumb on. And you hold it just like you do clock, but put the thumb off the box lid. So then, you don't, don't even pick it up, just start going back and forth. You ain't gotta put no pressure in it at all. So you're, you're picking it up, just go back and forth. Yeah, so you're getting it. You, don't, you ain't picking it up, you just. All right, let's see how well they learn, Jacob. Everybody be quiet. Berkeley, you're on. Let's see what you learn. All right. Can you do your cluck? But all you gotta do is simple. Just leave like this, then just slide open. Let it glide against these. Just All right, Fisher, you're on, baby. All right, try your cluck. Very good. All right, one last call uh, from you, Jacob. Excellent instruction. Guys, did you learn a little something today? Yeah, a lot. All right, Jacob is going to share with us their number one turkey killing call so this, this right here this is called a cluck and purr pot this is probably the most deadliest turkey call you'll ever see in turkey woods so it's a little bit longer striker than a normal pot call so what you do right here it's simple just get right in the middle Turkeys can hear that from a hundred yards away. That's and that's all you're doing is doing turkey calling. I mean, just turkey talk. Not your own. Not only calling, you're just talking. That's right. So again, something that light, they can hear up to a hundred yards. That's right. You heard it here. Thank you a lot, Jacob. All right, folks, here's the full line of box calls from Woodhaven Custom Calls here in Heflin, Alabama. Just a few of the trophies. Safe.